Well, hello, everyone, and welcome to iGospel Broadcasting Network News. I'm Prophetess Nona Thomas. And I'm Minister Sherry Gallagher. And we're so excited to be here with you. Oh, my goodness. We've got some great things to share with you. And we want to let you know that we're here to discuss all the upcoming things here at IGBN and how we want you to be a part of it and what the Lord is doing right here, right here in this region with IGBN. Amen. Praise God. Oh, Lord Jesus. Well, God is good. And I just want to say I'm just glad to be here with I'm you. I'm glad to be here too. <laughs> Amen. I'm glad to be here today. Amen. Amen. You want to start with the scripture yes, today? Yes, let's do that. We're, our scripture today, our pick scripture today is Matthew 6, 31 through 34. And it reads, so do not worry saying, what shall we eat? Or what shall we drink? Or what shall we wear? For the pagans run after all these things. Mm, mm, mm. And your heavenly father knows that you need them. Hallelujah. But seek ye first his kingdom and his righteousness. And all these things will be given to you as well. Hallelujah. That's good news. That's good news. Praise God. Therefore, do not worry about tomorrow. For tomorrow will worry about itself. Mm. Each day has enough trouble of its own. Hallelujah. That's so true. Amen. (laughs) Amen. Can we drop the mic right there? We can drop the mic right (laughs) there. Amen. We want to encourage you that no matter what is going on in your life to hear the good news about Jesus. As Christians, you know, we build our lives. We simply build our lives on the good news, the gospel of Jesus Christ. Don't you agree? Yes, we do. Good. So we're going to start in prayer. Prayer is always appropriate, guys. Always appropriate. So, Heavenly Father, Father God, in the name and through the blood of Jesus, we love you. We honor you. We thank you for being our King of kings and Lord of lords. And we thank you for iGospel Broadcasting Network. We thank you for everyone who is watching right now in the name of Jesus, God. We bless you. We give you the glory. We thank you, God, that the words that we speak will be encouraging and a blessing to your people. We love you, Mm, Master, mm, mm. who wouldn't serve a God like you. Hallelujah. Amen. We give you the glory, the honor, and the praise for which you are due. In Jesus' name. Praise God. Praise God. Mm -hmm, Amen. mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. You know, there could be some folks who are watching us for the first time. You think? Maybe I hope one so. or two or so. a million are watching us right now for the first time. <laughs> so we want to share with you so that you understand what our vision is and what our Amen. mission is and how we're going to accomplish all that. Praise can God. You, can you let us know? Oh, I would love to tell them about IGBN. <laughs> now, IGBN, just for those of you who may be wondering what the I stands for, it stands for Internet. Someone asked me the other day, yep. I've been telling people it stands for International <laughs> We which like we that are, too. which we are international, but this is based. The beginning of it was based on the idea of broadcasting over the internet through YouTube, through Facebook, through social media, and stuff like this. You know, and eventually maybe we'll expand to you know traditional ways of broadcasting. But for right now, we're on the internet. That's where Amen. you find us. Amen. Amen. <laughs> Praise God. So it's the Internet Gospel Broadcasting Network, which we just say I I G B N. Amen. <laughs> Praise God. But our vision here is to provide low to no cost avenues of broadcasting for ministers, churches, to expand the good news of Jesus Jesus Christ. Christ. I mean, that's what we're here to do, to expand the good news of Jesus Christ and to help others to do the same. Amen. And we do that through uh, through hosting various outreaches, you know, um, community events, uh, Christian performances, family recreational activities, anything basically that can help bring the community together and broadcast, you know, the good news of Jesus Christ. We also do it through providing tools and technology for the expansion of the kingdom of God. Amen? Amen. amen. Praise God. And well, you know what? Because of he gave us the the, the ways to do that mm-hmm. through the mission, we mm-hmm. just want to share with you some of the ways that God has done that just in this month of May. Oh, my God. Mm-hmm. You want to tell them a little bit about some of the things we've done recently? I will. I will. Well, and you know, I 
we had to have it written down because there's so much, right? So much going on. So we had a wonderful healing and delivering service oh, that was right here God. with Apostle Meaty Joseph. Jesus. Let me tell you, it was just powerful. Whew. And we will be announcing further mm. uh, healing and delivering services. Uh, you got to find a way. You know, there's a friend of mine. There's a bishop friend of mine. He says, if you got a hitch, if you got a hitch on the wings of a fly. <laughs> now you really want to get here. That might be difficult. Okay. <laughs> but you might want to get here. <laughs> that shows you got to try, okay, mm. to get here. And so also we had uh, the Christian Women's Business Conference was just amazing, wasn't it? Oh, it truly was. It was so amazing. I mean, the, the speakers, each one was so very necessary. Mm -hmm. I mean, each one mm -hmm. I thought, well, maybe this one I don't need to listen to. Mm -hmm. But then when I heard what she had to say, I was like, I need to get with you. I kept saying that, oh, man, I need to get with you. I mm -hmm. need to get mm -hmm. with you. Because each one had their own focus and yes. what God had placed in their heart. It was so needed and necessary for the body of Christ. It was on time. And especially for women. Yes. Amen. Yes, it was so on time. And we thank uh, Reverend Monica Peterson for yes. being obedient to that vision. My Glory God. to God. Woo. And we had a moment there woo, where the <laughs> spirit did. broke out. We thought we were just there to learn some stuff about business, but the Holy Ghost came <sighs> down, pushed our agendas aside, mm -hmm. and had his way. Yes. I mean, there was dancing, mm -hmm. there was prophesying, mm -hmm. there was giving. I mean, the, the all the gifts were in operation, yes. and you just had to say, God, when you can step into the midst oh, of yeah. a business conference and do that, oh. You're amazing. Oof. We serve an amazing my God, y'all. Oh, I, I, I tell you this. Mm -hmm. Just one person, and, and they didn't say it about the conference, but they actually said it about the healing and deliverance service. But it goes for all the events. Sure, sure. They, they hadn't been able to make it out to the healing and victory service, you know, deliverance service. And, um, and then when they heard about everything that happened, their comment was, and they were really talking to themselves, but I heard them, you know, <laughs> but they said, man, I feel I really missed out. I missed something, yeah, you know, yeah. and, and it's not because that they didn't want to be here, you know, but life happens, life, life, life. happens. They're here for most of our events, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. you know, but that one event they didn't, they didn't get to make it to. And then so much happened yes. and you always think to yourself, well, I've, I've already gone to this event this week, or I've already gone to that event. Mm -hmm. You know, I can skip this one. Mm -hmm. But, you know, it's the one you skip because that's the one you need the most. My, my, my. <laughs> I mean, you just really want to be here for all of it if you can. That's right. That's right. And, and we that's understand. That's my take on it. <laughs> Life happens. We get it. But when you can, mm -hmm. push on through. Get, push on through. Push on through. Push on through. And then we also had the prophetic overflow uh, service, which was just uh, it was right in the Christian Business Women's Conference, and it was such a blessing. The Lord moved. He always does. We have that every third Saturday of the month. However, in June, it's going to be on the second, the second Saturday of the month in our IGBN telethon, and we're going to talk more about that, too. Oh, yes, we are. Mm -hmm. Yes, mm -hmm. we mm -hmm. are. Mm -hmm. Now, just to piggyback a little bit on what we already talked about, mm -hmm. the Christian Women's Business Conference. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Now, that was here, held here at IGBN, but it was not an actual IGBN event. It was actually an event for NARC. You want to talk Correct. a little bit about both that ministry and also how other ministries and, and people can rent our facilities for their events? Indeed, indeed. So the Narcissistic Abuse Recovery Center, which was founded by the CEO, uh, Monica, Reverend Monica L. Peterson. And so she held the event here because we are in a, a venue space. We yes. offer a spectacular uh, facility. Uh, our light sound is just stellar, mm -hmm. just stellar. Mm -hmm. And so she rented our space for that conference and was extremely pleased. And so we encourage you to give us a call at 314-499-6200 and we can schedule a tour. Talk about your your vision for the event because we want to make that happen. We mm -hmm. want to be a yes, part of whatever yes, the Lord has given you yes, to do. We do. So 314-499-6200 or you can go to the website real easy, igbn.org. 
That's right. If you go to the website, scroll on down to the bottom, there's a place to, that says make a reservation. Now, you're not actually re reserving the spot, but rather you're reserving uh, a, a, a call so that we can get in touch with you and go over what you need and, you know, the, the dates are available and all that other stuff. You can also uh, email us with questions at igospelbn at gmail.com. Amen? That's it. Praise God. Praise God. Well, we don't want to take up too much time on that, but we did want to let you know that we are available right. to host your events. Right. We also have other services that we provide. We have a green screen. We have editing services. If you have videos that need editing, um, we do provide those services as well. We, uh, we do recordings for like radio shows and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. Um, you do your radio shoot through us, don't you? Indeed. I have two radio programs <laughs> That's that right. are done through our stellar services here yep. at IGBN. So if you have a dream, if you have mm -hmm. a vision of something that you want to yeah. start, call us. Yeah, we, we may be able to help you. Help you. Yes, we can. Indeed. We can Indeed. help you. <laughs> mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Amen. Praise God. Well, I just wanted to let you know about that. Now we now we want to talk about some of our of our upcoming events. We don't want you to miss out on, on anything. You, we don't want you feeling bad afterwards going, oh, man, that I sounded so great. I wish I could have been there. <laughs> so we're going to tell you about them so that you can plan your schedule ahead of time to make room for what God wants to do in your life through IGBN. Amen? Amen. Praise God. Well, one of the first things I want to talk about, we talked earlier about our vision and how we uh, host uh uh, recreational activities for the family and we've got one coming up this uh this friday don't we this, this friday this friday our very first movie and game night praise god hallelujah <laughs> a free event come on out with your family with your friends with your neighbors with your co-workers and uh let's just hang out and fellowship you know, let's all be fellows in the same ship, right? Okay. okay. I've never heard it quite like that, but I like it. I like oh, it. Oh, my old pastor used to say that, Rob Parsley. And, uh, <laughs> but um, come hang out with us, you know, watch a movie, uh, a family-friendly movie, and uh, play some games. We've got ping pong. We've got Jenga. We've got board games, Monopoly. I mean, we've got it all. We've got it all. Yes, Amen. Yes. I'm not going to belabor the point, but it's going to be a good time. I mean, I'm I'm going to be here. Are you going to be I'm here? I'm going to be here. Oh, don't you want to hang out here. with us? We good folk. <laughs> <laughs> we good folk. We yes, good we folk. Are. We good folk. Oh, praise the Lord. Now, we just finished the prophetic overflow service, but as we said... It's monthly, although that is changing. It's yep, gonna be gonna it's have... gonna be twice a month coming up soon, but we'll announce that when it happens. But our next overflow service is gonna be during our telephone, which we'll tell you about in a minute. But first, let's talk about the overflow service that's coming up in June. You wanna tell them a little bit about that since I will. it's your baby? I will. <laughs> you know, um God has just been so good. He uh he's faithful. Amen. Anybody know about that? He's he faithful. He is faithful. And he has been faithful with the prophetic overflow services. He's been faithful. We thank God for those who have been coming. We thank God for our volunteers, for our musicians, for our usher. We we just thank God for our psalmist. I mean, you all know who you are, but I'm going to say your name anyway. I just think I need to say their names. Oh, we God. thank God for Evangelist Josie Marshall. We oh. thank God for all she does. Yes. We thank God for Minister Angie Harnaday, who is our yes, Minister indeed. of Music. We thank God for psalmist donna marie reese you all are faithful mm, mm, you're mm. dedicated and we thank god for you Praise we thank god, god for our newest uh, uh uh addition none other than our new drummer mr ralph he is exceptional and oh, yes, he is yes. excited about yes. igbn yes, and we is. want you to come out every third saturday 3 p.m all right and we're going to be making a change to that soon and we'll announce that Oh, yes. Yes, we do. Mm -hmm. And if you've got a gift for the guitar, we could sure mm. use you. All right. All right. <laughs> I'm just saying. I'm just, just saying. Put that out there. Maybe the Lord is stirring some hearts, you know. Maybe maybe you got a gift for the triangle. Ding, ding. <laughs> I'm just saying. I, you don't know. You never if, know. If you're a musician, if you're a singer, and God has put it on your heart to, you know, um, 
use those talents for his kingdom. We would love to give you an opportunity to use those gifts here, both during our services and during our special events like our worship nights. Amen. Amen. Praise God. Oh, man, I'm excited about that overflow service. I'm, I'm excited, but I'm also excited. Mm, about our telethon. <laughs> oh, yes, yes, Ooh. yes. Oh, my God. I just can't wait for the telethon. Mm-hmm. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Whew. Wow. Well, you want me to tell them? Yes, about? I do. Okay. Our telethon, our IGBN telethon, we do it quarterly, and it's coming up June 11th. Now, mm-hmm. let me tell you what goes on for 12 hours. Mm. The word, the word, the word, the word, the word. We will have uh, pastors, ministers from all over the country who are going to be giving the word of God. And in between there, Mm -hmm. we'll also have praise and worship. We'll have just everything to get you into the presence of Mm -hmm. the Lord. And we also are so excited that we have a live audience that is there during this 12 hours. So Mm -hmm. you are are in this region. We want to encourage you to come out to 13745 Shoreline Drive in Earth City, Missouri, Mm -hmm. because this is the place to be on Saturday, June 11th. And then inside of the telethon at Mm -hmm. 3 p.m., we will have our prophetic overflow service. It's going to be some kind of day. Oh, it's going to be some kind of day. And not only preachers, though, Mm -hmm. there will be singing and there Mm -hmm. will be music and Mm -hmm. there will be performers. Mm -hmm. I mean, you just never know what's going to happen. So true. (laughs) I mean, we may just end up running around the sanctuary. (laughs) Who knows when the Holy Ghost gets going. I just, I can't wait. And it just went up a notch when we started doing live audiences. Oh my God. I just, I just can't tell you the things that have happened in the past and the things that are coming. God's getting ready to do a new thing. Mm -hmm. I mean, we, we, we are expecting, we are expecting, you should be expecting to, you should be expecting it. If you're expecting, make sure that you put the time aside to be there. Uh, You can be a part of our live audience here in the actual sanctuary, the Glory Be Now Auditorium, which is looking great, by the way. Oh, the transformation from the beginning to what it is now, and it is continuing to improve Almost daily. I mean, God is just adding new stuff it's, daily. It's just, you know. Who wouldn't serve a God like this? Who wouldn't serve a God like this? Amen. But if you can't make it here to be a part of our live audience, please make the time to watch online. You can watch uh, live on mm-hmm. YouTube mm-hmm. and Facebook. Mm -hmm. So whichever you prefer, we have the ability to broadcast it straight into your home and the anointing will go with it. I'm telling you right over the airwaves, right over the airwaves, Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. you can get healed. You can get delivered. Mm -hmm. You can get a word that will set you free. Mm. Amen. Amen. Oh that's my good God. News. That's good news. That is good news. Mm-hmm. That is, and that's mm-hmm. what we provide here is good, good news. news. <laughs> oh my God. I, who I just felt the anointing all over that. Mm-hmm. I don't know about you. Mm-hmm. Oh, well, our last worship night, our last worship night was off the chain. Yes. Yes. I mean, I actually, the Holy Spirit hit me so hard. I started dancing and spinning. <laughs> oh God. Yeah. And I told a friend of mine the other day, I said, I had not come prepared to do that. You know, when you little got a little weight on you, you got to prepare to dance and spin because you got to be sucked in with, you know, I'm just saying I wasn't prepared <laughs> for all that. But I swear to God, God, oh, he did a work. Yeah, he delivered right. me from a couple of things. I, you know, people look at you and they think, oh, you don't got nothing going on. I mean, you smile, you laugh, you, you're anointing. Nothing's going wrong in your life, but I'm telling you, everybody's got issues. Everybody has things that they need God to deliver them from, to do for them, to give them a word for, and I'm sure it's the same with you, and he did a work for me, so I'm expecting for the next one, and we don't have the dates yet, but when we do, we will let you know, and you definitely want to be a part of it. You definitely want to be a part of it. Amen? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Praise. Without a doubt. God. (laughs) Amen. Woo, hallelujah. If you are a musician and singer interested in being a part of our next worship night, we are already recruiting for that time. Um, Please give us a call at 314 
Nona, you want to tell them about some of the broadcasts that are that are going on or that are coming up? Well, Nona, you want to tell them about some of the broadcasts that are that are going on or that are coming up? Well, uh, I do want to talk about that and also want to talk about how if you would like, if you're a pastor, mm-hmm. if you're a minister and you would like to, uh, you know, speak on the good news of Jesus Christ mm-hmm. for IGBN, look, let me tell you how to do it. It's real simple. You can send your video to IGBN.org. Okay, just go on the website. You'll see information. Mm-hmm. Or you can call us at 314-499-6200. We do want to let you know that we have a vetting process. So, you know, once you submit everything and then we review it, we will let you know if it will be airing and how soon. So Mm -hmm. we want you to call us, 314-499-6200. Was there something else I'm supposed to do? Yeah, you're supposed to do that one. Oh, okay, okay, okay. (laughs) All right. So we've got some great broadcasts. It's more good news, y'all. Never stop. This is real. Real time, y'all. Real time. (laughs) So we've got some great original broadcasts that are coming to you from IGBN. Um, uh, We have the Prophetic Table um, that I host. And the Prophetic Table, we all have guests that come on. And and we talk about whatever the Lord would have us to talk about Mm -hmm. and, and give a word to someone who's watching as the Lord leads us. Mm-hmm. It's, it's powerful, the prophetic table. And then we also have Testimony Tuesdays. Yes, and we are collecting testimonies right now. We've got some that are coming down the line, so mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. it should be very soon mm-hmm. when we'll finally get to broadcast our first testimony for Tuesday testimonies. That's right. Well, so we're in mm-hmm. preparation. So be in preparation with us. Yes. And give us a call at 314 314- Four nine nine six two zero zero. For more information, if you have a testimony, yes, we want the please. world to know yes, about it. Yes, yes. And and just to to piggyback on that, mm-hmm. exactly what kind of testimonies we may be looking for. Believe me, we're looking for anything that God has done for you in your life. It may be a testimony on how you got saved. It may be a testimony on how you got delivered, how you got healed, how God prospered you, how he saved your family members. Whatever it is that God has done for you in your life, he's worthy of the praise. Don't you believe that? And if you do, remember, your testimony is someone else's deliverance. It will help somebody to hold on, to believe, and maybe even to finally receive what it is that God has for them in their life. Amen? That's a good word right there. And then also, the first morning meditations with the word will be airing soon. Now, we're going to let you know when, but just know that it's coming. And that is going to be hosted by none other, our morning Bible devotion from Minister Sherry Gallagher. And she's the founder of God Pleasers International. Oh my, we all want to be a part of God Pleasers uh, International because we now. want to please him. Amen? We want to please him. We're not mm-hmm. here to be men pleasers, mm-hmm. <laughs> to, to, to build our foundation of our life upon what other people think of us and uh, what is it called? The politically correct mm-hmm. thing to do. Mm-hmm. You know, we're not looking for that. We're looking for the approbation of, of the Holy Spirit Mm -hmm. and the King of Kings and the Lord of Lords, his opinion, the one who went to the cross for me. Mm -hmm. That's the one I want to please. Amen. So (laughs) So, amen. Praise the Lord. I think so. Now you've got to tell us about the the ways that folks can donate because it's very important, you know, and it ties into our telethon as well. Oh, yes. Okay, so let's talk about donations. Praise the God. Now don't turn it off just because we're starting to talk about donations. <laughs> but let us let me tell you about sowing a seed into the kingdom of God. When you sow a seed, you are expecting a harvest. That's what it means. That's all it means. If you sow a seed, that means that you are preparing yourself to receive something from God. Mm-hmm. Uh, I'm just, you know, mm-hmm. that's that's what the Lord said to me. Praise God. Mm-hmm. <laughs> and um, and so we want to give you that opportunity. This is good ground. Yes. God is doing things here. You don't want to you don't want to sow into dry and thirsty ground. You want to sow into something that's rich soil, you know, that's being watered, that's, you know, that's being uh, uh, 
it's it's alive. Yes, and growing. And growing. Mm -hmm. And this place is alive. And the things that are happening here, God is growing things here. So this is good soil for you to sow into. Amen. So some of those ways that you can sow, you can go to our website at igbn.org. You want to scroll to the place where it says donate here. Click on that. It gives you all the different ways that you can sell. There's PayPal where you can just, you know, type in your actual credit card, debit card number. There's also, if you're an app person and you like to give over the apps, we have Cash App. For that, you would be looking for the dollar sign, iGospelBN. And if you prefer Venmo, you want to type in there the at sign, IGBN dash. Amen? Amen. We've got every way possible that we can think of that's, right. that's commonly used that's right. to help you plant a seed into this good ground. That's right. I mean, that's that's good news. In fact, I believe we've given good news ever since we started this morning, yes. don't you think? Oh, you know what? The Holy Spirit just said something to me. Some of you guys are old school and you prefer to write checks. You can send in a check. Do you want to tell them our address? Of course. You can send it to 13745 Shoreline Drive. That's one word. S-H-O-R-E-L-I-N-E. -E, Earth City, Missouri. 63045. Yes. The mail still works too. That's right. And you want to address it to either IGBN or iGospel Broadcasting Network. Either of those will work. Amen. 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 You know, there's just been so much that we've talked about and there's mm -hmm. so much that's going on in the world. And, you know, we want to encourage folks, of course, to continue to always pray for Ukraine yeah. uh, because of the war going that's going, going on. Too. But there are some things that in are addition happening. Yeah. right now, yes. right now in this region, in mm -hmm. the, in the world and in our country. And no. so, you know, as you pray us out, woman of God, just, you know, just touch on those things, you know, and, and so much and also in the households of those who are watching you know what since you said it i think the lord think? was moving <laughs> moving upon you you know we have a rule here if you say it <laughs> you pray it <laughs> <laughs> we do we really do we really do so praise him praise, praise him. god so heavenly father in the name of jesus great king great master that you are we honor you we thank you god for this broadcast mm -hmm. today we thank you for all of those who are watching the families the individuals we want we thank you god that they're watching yes. whether it's two o'clock in the morning, yes, 12 during the day, whenever they're watching God, yes, we thank you that the spirit of the Holy Ghost yes, is alive and, and, yes, and thriving yes, and falling upon them right now in yes, Jesus name. Jesus. We speak God that the, the world, the, the war that is going on yes, right yes, now in, in Ukraine and other wars that are going on in, yes, in other yes, countries, yes. God, and the war that's going on right here on yes, our own yes, ground in the yes, United yes, States, Jesus. the war of yes, poverty, yes, the war yes. of discrimination, Nation, yes, the war Jesus. of killings, the yes, war Lord of Jesus. just on and on and on. Yes, you Jesus. know, God, it's yes, not Lord enough Jesus. time to yes, list it all. But Father, you said yes, for us to cast yes, all Lord of our Jesus. cares upon you, yes, for Lord you Jesus. care for us. Yes, so Father, we come dragging, dragging yes, those heavy bags because we can't Jesus. carry it, God. And we, we send Thank it to you. Jesus. We give it to you, yes, God. Jesus. And we know that you, yes, God, you yes. will fix it. Yes, fix it, God. Yes, fix it however you want it to yes, be done, God. For your word says, Thank not you, by my will, our will, but thy will be done. Hallelujah. Amen. Let your word be done. God, continue to have a hedge of protection around yes, our gospel Lord broadcasting yes, network. Jesus. All of the staff, all of the yes, volunteers, those yes, who are to Lord come. Jesus. We thank you, God, for yes, what Lord you're Jesus. doing with this powerful network. Yes, we Jesus. give you all of the glory. All we give glory. you all of the praise yes, on Lord which Jesus. you are due. King of kings, yes, great Lord master yes, that you Lord are. Jesus. And we all say yes, Amen. 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 And to God, God be, be the, the glory. glory.